Winston-Salem State versus Johnson C. Smith, a matchup in the CIAA South. Uh, Winston-Salem State started out. I got the ball first. Uh, you see them driving here. Double passes. Chase Powell, another pass uh, across the middle. Uh, got a nice drive going. Uh, homecoming for WSSU. They came into the game 4-1, four, four big wins in a row. Uh, up against a good Johnson C. Smith team. You see Rudy Johnson hitting Chase Powell here for a big game. Uh, got Maurice Lewis who had a big day on the ground and for Winston Salem State. And then you have Rudy Johnson going in uh, by his solo self, going in the spring touchdown. WFSU is up 7 as well. Uh, but Johnson C. Smith uh, did respond with a drive of its own. Uh, here you see quarterback Keon Wallace scrambling, uh, making things happen. And eventually it ended up in a touchdown pass, as you see here. Uh, now we're tied at 7 7. Um, WSSU during the first half had a, a little bit of a problem uh, protecting the quarterback. Uh, he was on the ground a lot early, and uh, JCSU was at, would actually take a would actually take a 14 to 7 lead at one point. Again, this is homecoming game for Western State, so you see the fans and the stands are pretty well packed. Um, so at this point. Uh, get a sack here on Wallace, and the game ended up being 14-14 at halftime. So, Winston-Salem um, State has a big time winning streak. Uh, it was put in jeopardy here, but then they started to pull away in the third quarter after they went down 17. Uh, after they went down 17 to 14, they went on a huge scoring run, eight uh, points in a row unanswered and as they would end up taking away the victory. So the Rams now improved to five and one, five straight wins. Francis C. Smith now drops to four and two uh, with two losses in the CIAA. Uh, so now Winston State, State is in control of its destiny right now. You see the band, you see the cheerleaders, everyone having a good time. There's the 15,000 plus at Bowman Gray Stadium. And the final score was Winston-Salem State 44, Johnson C. Smith 17. This has been Stephen Gaither, HBCU Game Day. Thank you for reading and watching. Take care.